Hey guys, you're watching Trend Makers with Isidore Baltazar. So today we are going to review a few videos. I'm going to start looking at this Beyonce's Ivy Park Adidas Drip 2 video on YouTube. We're going to, I think, I believe she's going through like her cloning line. I haven't seen this yet, guys. So this is brand new for me. I know you guys probably already seen it because it's been a few weeks now. But uh, let's get into it. I'm so excited. Okay. Check Beyonce out. Okay, okay. <laughs> I already have thoughts. I'm not trying to be a dick or nothing. Cause I know, you know, so I'm part of the beehive, so don't attack me. But Beyonce got a gang of padding. <laughs> I, th I feel like that's padding. I don't know if that's all her, oh, that's that babies, <laughs> but uh, that should look bad. In. Okay, let's see. But it was cute though. That I like the little waist bag thing. It's really cute. <clears throat> oh yes, I like the fact that she's giving so much color this time. Oh, maybe I just really like these colors. Oh, that shit is cute. But can somebody tell me what's on her feet? Is that socks and like clear heels? If you know, tell me. Comment. Subscribe while you at it. The fuck are those? See, this stuff is really cute. These pieces, it's like really easy to wear. And you can clearly dress it up, dress it down. I love this from Adidas for her. That is fly. See, but this looks like something that she had in the first one. The first collection that she did that was like burgundy. That kind of was reminiscent to Popeyes. <laughs> no, see that? You see how high that booty is padded. But that's cute though. I like the pants. Okay. It's a lot of like athleisure, uh, athletic wear, casual stuff. I'm guessing this is just the lane that she's gonna stick in for this go round. But I'm not mad at it. I love those colors. That was a color from my wedding, that hunter green. That is cute. Beyonce is doing the damn thing. You know what? Hold on, let me pause this real quick. Cause we got a, a lot to do still, but still, but let me just say this. Um, I'm liking so far what I'm seeing from her. Like the silhouettes are a little reminiscent, but it's like she's taking the key things and then stepping it up and then doing another color, like a whole nother color story. So I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. Yeah, I'm really here for it. It's super cute and it's really smart. I don't know. Now, okay, are these shades just for this or is this something that she's actually selling? Again, tell me down below. I, Cause I haven't, you know, I haven't looked at this actual collection and to see like the prices or any of that stuff. So like I said, guys, this is all brand new, all brand new, at least for me. So you're getting my real reaction. Ooh. Cute sneakers. I don't know what's going on with the top, but I like it. Oh, okay, I see. So it's like a bustier thing, but it has like the mesh underneath. It's cute. This is cute. Beyonce got hella thick. Is she pregnant in this? Or did she just have a baby? <laughs> God damn. Court teach you her right. <laughs> she looks good. Yes, I love that. Okay, okay, this right here, I like that a lot. I like that a lot. 
Okay, I'm gonna say this, guys. I did work for Brian Lichtenberg a few years back while I was just getting out of college, the end of college. Um, and he had something similar to the silhouette. It kind of gives you, like, an, it forces your body to have that hourglass shape because it has those cuts in it. Let me uh, rewind just a little bit so you can see what I'm talking about. The way they have those pieces, okay, perfect. The way that they have those pieces in there, it gives her, like, this kind of, like, banging ass silhouette um and then the highlight in yellow just to give the uh just to accentuate the curves is just like wrapping her and hugging her like in all the right places i think this would look great on probably any kind of uh figure actually she she's so smart she is so smart sorry i just had to that was that's nice and very different cute I fucking hate them shades though. I'm sorry. I'm not into those Ivy Park shades. I hope it's just for this and not like real life or trying to sell. Yes. Okay, we see the little back again. Oh, it's two. Oh, that is cute. Watch it be. Oh, okay. This is a cute color story. I'm not. Ugh, I'm glasses. Okay. Okay, I like that. I like that. That's cute. That's cute. So it's like really active, but you can still put your sneaker. I guess a sneaker chain. I don't know what that is, but I like it. Okay. Okay. This is different. I mean, I do wish she had some other models, though. <laughs> Beyonce, don't she could afford another model besides just her in all the clothes. Okay, this is cute, though. It's cute. I like that. I like all of this stuff. It's very, like, casual and chic. Okay, Beyonce twerking once again. This is probably why I've, this is the first time. I love Beyonce, but I'm not about to just sit here and watch all of this all the time. I don't know how many people watch this multiple times, but you're nuts. Okay. Cute. I even like the makeup that she has going on. Because it's suddenly changing with every look. I'm noticing her makeup is giving you a little something different. So I like it. The overall look for each of these have been actually really, really good. Um, whoever is styling, I don't know if it's her herself doing it or she has a team behind her. But whatever is going on here, I'm loving it. Each look is giving like a different vibe. And she's just like putting things on and taking things off. So it's going, it's showing you like how... Um, how versatile each look is because one is like heels one is sneakers beanie no beanie you know it's giving you variation with the same look so this is good this will take your wardrobe to a nice long stretch okay so yeah now the sh the share jacket thing uh, like i said i love it but it just doesn't seem and feel very practical now i mean i don't know what the fabric feels like again I haven't touched any of these things. I haven't got up close and personal to these things. Um, Beyonce, if you're listening, you want to send me these clothes just to review, I'll take it. <laughs> but um, I definitely like the look. Don't get me wrong. Um, I just don't, like, I don't see how, like, what and where and why. But, I mean, it's cute. It is very cute. So let's get back into the rest of these things here. And even her hair is cute. Like the way she did, got the loose bird curls there at the bottom. Very cute. This just looks like a workout outfit, but I think it's cute though. Cute workout outfit. You're definitely not gonna get hit by no car. <laughs> that lime green. <laughs> okay. I don't know what's going on here. Um, but I mean, I guess it's cute. It can be cute. Uh, this is probably my least favorite look, honestly, uh, to tell you the truth. Definitely my least favorite look. Um, I, I get the whole athletic, um, athleisure thing that she has going on there. Um, I understand all of that. Um, I get the, the, the loose shorts. Um, I get the beanie. Uh, what I don't get is the, um, actually I don't get the loose shorts. 
that's the that's the one thing that's that's stopping me. If it maybe it was a little bit shorter, um, the length is like awkward to me. The fact that the pocket is like dropping off, it's a cool thing. Um, but I, I just feel like it needs to be a little bit like maybe mid thigh and I think it would be cuter because you are being This is athletic wear and you're out and about you're running or whatever the case may be I get it Maybe you don't want your whole booty out whatever so you want to be a little bit of a short over the the tight pant I get it, but uh, the short just needs to, the to me the length looks like it's off I don't know. Let me know if you agree But this is this has to be hands down my least favorite look so far I like this again. I'm loving these bags that the things that she's doing with these little like athletic bag things are cute. Well, I don't know, guys. That was different. Um, yeah, it was different. Um, I, but it's cool. Well, I definitely can see uh, the growth between the first time she did it and this um, the second one that she's doing. And I get, I, I can see why people would be like into it and why people are going crazy for it and why they would spend money for it. Oh, hold on, let me mute this thing. Um, and why they would spend money for it. Like that makes perfect sense. Um, again, one of those things, Beyonce already has like a strong fan base. She already has like, you know, a big following is Queen B. Who doesn't freaking love her? Um, I'm hoping that there's like a men's thing here because again, Beyonce was the only person modeling the clothes. So I don't know if it's like a men's collection that she has going along with this or tagging on behind this. But if she doesn't yet have something for guys, she needs to do it. Because a lot of these uh, clothes can trans um, can really transfer well like into a men's clothing line. Um, and I really feel like there's a, there's a niche for that. Um, I don't really see a lot of like athletic leisure clothes for men that are like pulling it to to something really cool and and different. Like it usually just goes into the lane of oh that's like an urban streetwear or that's just like you know whatever preppy or whatever. It usually goes to like different. You know what I mean? Like has pockets, but like an athletic leisure wear for men, no. But I don't see that being a common thing. I mean, if there is, and I mean I see Nike track pants and stuff, but that's not that's just track pants. So if they can do like some really cool stuff like what she's doing here for women, but for men, Beyonce, get that popping. Uh, that, and if you need some help, I can be the designer. I'm just throwing it out there for you. Isidore Baltazar graduated from Art Institute, California, fashion designer. <laughs> All right, guys. So uh, I'm going to be looking at something else next time, and then you'll get my commentary on that please let me know uh your thoughts make sure you like and subscribe to trend makers and i have a lot more good content coming out guys where i'm going to be focusing on different trends and looks hair and makeup nails all that good beautiful stuff that you want to know about and not just for women but for men too so make sure you uh you like subscribe and you tune in see you next time